So this is the real-time corruptor made by Irkluzar. And, um, well, I'm going to wing it. We had some issues. I figured out some of them. They figured out most of them. Thank you, guys. You know who you are. And Irkluzar was kind enough to make me a version of the RTC that doesn't resize the window so we can get a really good, you know, consistent corruption experience here on the stream. A more pleasurable gaming and corruption experience. So I'm uh, very excited to check this out. We're going to start with some stockpiles. And then we're going to do Mario 64 Nightmare Mode, which will just be done live. It'll be all corruptions. Live Mario 64 corruptions. And I have a little guide on how to make that happen. And it's not too complex, but it should be... It should be interesting. I mean, it's not like the Chaos Edition where everything was programmed in there. This is just the corruption takes over the game and creates a totally random and unpredictable experience and that's only possible with RTC 3.0 which you know the longest for the longest time the big challenge was how do we get stable N64 corruptions well by god I don't know how Phil did it but he did it why don't we start with um On second thought, may maybe not. Okay. Oh, oh. A little earthbound, nice colors and... You know what? Let me get rid of the mouse there. Um, yeah. Let's see if I can decrease the window a bit. Yeah. Alright, so this is, um, a stockpile by Smelly Feet you have, uh, what happened there? Good? Alright, good, good, good. So keep in mind, the Corruptor is also just better overall, like the whole experience is better. Which means, corruptions for anything are be-, are be Okay. Look at that, look at that fucking crow face. He knows he's shitposting. When you combine the music, the face of the crow, <laughs> and, and the text, it's a really good experience. I recommend you do that. Um, so yeah, a lot of these corruptions are, <laughs> are in fact, uh, but pr pr princess, pr princess. I don't think this is regular, Mario Brothers. Y you don't get the princess, but you get Consolation Turtle. So it's a really good prize for second place. Y you could maybe, you know, maybe the princess just didn't quite work out. Let's see, I have to resize some stuff. Okay, so the window we're gonna have to figure out on the fly. Keep in mind, by the way, this isn't going to be a 100% um, glitch-free experience on my end. This could be a pain in the ass. It's a brand new Corruptor. And there could be some problems. There could be some down moments. Um, there was a stockpile that didn't quite work, unfortunately, before. Uh, so, you know. That plus epilepsy warning and all that. So, I haven't played this game yet. Um... But I'm, I'm assuming the dinosaur wasn't supposed to just die like that. Huh. A core accepted the ROM, but threw an exception while loading it. Hmm. Let's see, that doesn't work. The Mario World Corruptions don't work. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I may have a way around this. Hang on. It's got to load up a backup configuration. So we're already... We're already running into problems. Um, the new crash sound 
Well, there's there's a couple of choices you have for the crash sound now. That's funny. Hang on a minute. Let me get rid of that stuff. Okay. All right. So I had to load his settings. That's a whole different story. Sometimes the things don't work, but you can load the settings. Whoa. Whoa. All right. Maybe this will work. It, it works. The name of this corruption is Racist Mario, not Clickbait. Now, I don't know what... I don't know what to say about this. I feel like it's clickbait. Smelly feet. I would argue that this is, in fact, quite clickbaity. And that you know exactly what you're doing. Oh my god. We can't, we can't, we can't do this. Nintendo does not do stuff like this. Come on. Yoshi's house. Um... We gotta, we gotta find Yoshi, it says. Okay. Kinda having a control issue. Hmm. Wow. Blood Yoshi. There's water in the sky, Mario! Hang on. We, we had an issue here with, um... Hmm. Ah. Oh, sir. I don't like it. I'm trying to rebind the controls and... And, uh, something weird's happen happening here. Let let's, let's see. Okay. No, no, no. We're good. We're good. And this is also... Con consider this. This is after... Like, an hour and a half to two hours of troubleshooting. So, why... This is B. I don't know why the controls just want to keep adding more buttons on top of previously established buttons. That wasn't happening before, but... Okay. Okay, much better. Okay. Now I can play the game. So it's pretty good. Pretty good. It's just a bloody Yoshi. Some good sounds. And... I'm not really into it. So that's why we have to fuck it up with a couple of manual blasts. Our old pal Emmanuel Blast is back. And he's harder than ever. <laughs> let's see, let's let's add some some extra magic to this. Okay, I think I went a little bit too far. I can no longer control Mario. And that was absolutely uneventful. Alright, next. Psychedelic Mario. I don't- I don't understand. How did I just take damage more than once? We're at like terminal fucking 9.7. Remember, it's like warp from Star Trek. You can't go faster than warp 10 unless you turn into a lizard. In Corruptions, terminal 10 means everything is fucked and lizard-like. And that's- that's- you can't come back from that, so this is like 9.7. Now I know you're waiting for the N64 corruptions, and there's plenty. We'll get to them in a bit. That's horrendously loud. So, uh... Here's some Pokemon Yellow corruptions. Let me show you the dance of my people. Oh, look, they get to dance together. That's nice. Dancing changes the world. It makes everyone happy. Memes wants to fight. 
trust me, that's not part of the corruption. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh, that was the pi oh my god. I forgot Pokemon Yellow had limited sound ab ability. Like, samples and stuff. That's, that's just so wrong. It's like, Pika! From the fucking depths of hell, a Pika rises. What? I, I didn't press anything. Item? I am absolutely not... ...understanding what's happening here. Okay. Hello, Professor Oak. It's close, right? Wait, oh my god. What are you doing to me, Professor Oak? What the fuck? Make it stop! From the fucking ninth circle of oblivion comes Pikachu. Yeah, no. No, 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 no. We're not doing any more of that. Pokemon Crystal. Centric. Lit AF. Well, wow, you're just like, you're just loading up the memes into these corruptions, aren't you? Hello, fellow kids. It is I, Vine Sauce, with your hip meme corruptions. Good music, though. Ah. Oh. Well. It's not often we get a visit from a fucking arcade game. But, um, yeah, here's- here- <laughs> here's Pac-Man playing- playing himself. I- I actually mean that because I can't control Pac-Man. Okay. Mega Man 3. Wow. What year are they fucking making Mega Man from? Oh, that was the Atari version, I apologize. The Atari version of, of Pac-Mang. Hard man. <laughs> I can't- I can't deal with it. sh 2 do man Now this- this would be his online handle. No Edelman is pretty cool too, and just man. <laughs> I like man and snake. These are really good. These are really good villains in the Mega Man universe. What? Well, what do you want? Okay. Um, for those who are curious, I have not seen the new Star Trek show yet. I haven't exactly been. Looking forward to it, but I plan on watching it sometime this week. I'll talk to you about it after I see it, I guess. Don't want to get that CBS All Access going, though. I'm going to avoid that like a fucking plague. Nice. Ready? Yeah, the default bindings for this are garbage. I have a button that presses two buttons at the same time. I don't understand this. Like, these are the worst bind- the j jump button is B, and the shoot button is X on the Xbox controller. Luckily, this is only corruptions. But I'm not going to spend my time rebinding these, only for them not to get saved. It just seems like a waste of time. Vinny should sell corruption and seizure glasses. What, like the eclipse glasses? Mank? Alright, I'm a big fan of Menk. He's from Manchester. He went to school with, uh, Carl. 
He listens to Oasis. He fucking loves Manchester United. Fucking loves them. You've got to wank the monk. That's how you defeat the boss. Boop, 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 boop. Mm-hmm. Okay. Thanks for the music. Appcom. Huh. This is very interesting. I don't think I've ever quite seen a corruption like this. Where the fucking level select turned into a goddamn sound check. <laughs> Eat a dick, Mega Man. Oh my god. This is, I can't... I can't figure out... I can't figure out what's happening. What the fuck? Hey, you might remember this. Ah, look, it's, uh, Sp Spuglablio, the newest brother. Mario's early years. Oh, one of his younger brothers, uh, Spugablio. Hey, how you doing? Uh, a fuller Waluigi joins the fray. Negative Yoshi is also here to stay, for there was not a sound throughout the house, not even a toad, or a dead mouse. Ayu. Ayu. A. music. What are we learning? Or have you learned? Are you smart yet? Do you know your ABCs? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> That's not Iggy. Nice fucking shepherd's tone we've got here. If I go, if I try to just go right, it goes right up. Nice key bindings, nice default key bindings we've got here. This is really, really good. Really good. Back, 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 back. Oh, I love this song. Whoa. Okay. Can, can we get a. Can we get that again, please? Crashing is going to be so much more fun now. Alright, up. I have to rebind some stuff. Priority. No, how do I do this? I feel like this was easier not too long ago to rebind controls. Now I have to press escape. Alright, so the, you know, it's a new thing. It's not my old corruptor. It's a new version of the RTC which is causing a bit of problem, a bit of commotion. Okay, let me save settings. Hopefully that saves. And we can back, go back, back to... Back, 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 
bag 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 Okay. Just a second before we get back to the lovely music. Got to do some more control configuration. Bag 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 Fuck off. Bag 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 why is it really uh, Mario's log, early years so log, fucked? Log, 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 So that's an optional crash noise for anyone who was curious about that. Let me see if I can get a window size here. That would be, uh, doesn't the window size just keeps defaulting back. So um, let me figure this out. Okay. So we'll, we'll, we'll go for, God damn it. Nope. Now the window size does not stay. So that's a little bit of a problem. I have to resize every single time there's a crash. You know, this was kind of like... I, I knew there would be some troubleshooting live on stream, but that's definitely something that is not very stream-friendly, which is um, figuring out the window size with corruptions. This has always been an issue pretty much since the beginning. Yeah. 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 Spin dong. <laughs> yeah. Now this is called Super Physics Cart. Okay, and even here now, the controls are kind of weird. Um, start. I need start to be the start button, please, so I can... Guess we'll do that again. Fuck! I always knew the Mushroom Kingdom was totally underwater. Hang on. Okay. I'm just gonna do some more configuration. Hopefully this will be a one-time thing. L and R. There's something wrong with L and R. Right shoulder. Okay. I just want to see maybe if it's possible. Nope. Fuck it. A shadow mode. Oh my oh my god. Wait a minute. Whoa. All right, this one's called ultimate mirror mode and Everything is reversed. Holy shit! We got, we got shit driving backwards. I'm driving backwards against my own fucking will. Toad is- That's where Toad is. Toad is upside down. Oh 
my god. Yeah, this is the only real way you play Mario Kart. If anything lower than this, and you know what the fuck you're doing. I'm telling you. You gotta play on ultimate mirror mode for the ultimate challenge. Okay, this, this one doesn't work. That's a shame. Okay, I guess I just have to restart. It's called Luigi Kart 64. I mean, it sounds great. <laughs> this is still not exactly a science, is it? It's close, but... Still no cigar for a lot of stuff. So this is Luigi Kart 64. <laughs> okay, this is pretty good. <laughs> it was worth it. It was worth the reset. <laughs> where are we going, Luigi? Maybe the better question is where are you going? How did you get a star? Where the fuck? Oh, alright. Well, no, never mind. We're going for a swim again. Super Gravity Cart is the name of this one. Why is it so loud? Oh my fucking god. Oh. Oh yeah, th th there you go. That explains a lot. Oh, okay, we're pumping. We're pumping! For some reason, I can't jump. Like, I haven't been able to at all. It's like, wha you know Wacky Races with Dick Dastardly and Muttley? It's like that. So, yeah, the window keeps, keeps, um, scaling down. Luigi's spinning again. This one's called Vinny Gets First Place. I'm excited. Oh, the window's fucked. Hang on. I haven't pressed a button yet, so I don't know if I'm actually going to get first place. No, <laughs> no, I'm not getting first place, but Dong is going fucking mental. Try that again. Okay, this is new. This is new. <laughs> it's just a close up of Dong. I, I I don't know why this is called Vinny Gets First Place. It has nothing to do with that. Okay, this one's called Link's Short Adventure. Yep. Just insta-death. Okay. It's an earthbound one. Uh, I'm getting an error. Where's that? Where's the crash button? 
One of the things I liked about the previous version was there was a button that you could press that would just restart the thing. And, uh, I'm not getting that now. I don't know where that is. It goes away, actually. It seems to just go away. Weird. Show me what you got. Yes. Only a few people know your amazing courage. This is what I got. <laughs> There's no way the cops are gonna keep us after that. Oh my... Oh my god. I guess this is what I got. On RTC hit settings, auto kill switch. Okay, I see. Okay, I'm still- still learning some of this stuff, too. Cool. So this is that classic Silver Surfer game. Reptile, huh? I guess we just keep going Terminal 10. That's the only- that's the only answer I have. Fucking game. Man, I hate this game so much. Oh. Doug, fuck. Stop. My left ear. This one's called Ding Dong Country. No, it's not. <laughs> okay, now it is. Reminds me of the classic days. Wanna be like an hour of DKC corruption per week. The giggle fits that I experienced during Donkey Kong Country corruptions I don't think will ever be matched. This one's called Space, the Final Frontier. Voyages of the starship Dong. It's continu to continuing mission to provide giggle fits, to fuck your ears, to boldly poke where no Dong has poked before. Some nice fucking hot garbage. Whoa! Run. Go away, Mario. Run away. Run away. The corruption is coming. <laughs> These fucking corruptions are getting more and more deadly.
Why would you listen to them, Nary? They sealed the monsters. So yeah, this is like, um... Yeah. It's Mario Brothers. I don't have anything interesting or witty to say. It's Mario Brothers. The birth of Shadow Mario. Later to show up in Super Mario Sunshine. Mario. Why do I have Fire Flower? I'm, I'm a fucking baby Shadow. I'm a Bab Crew Shadow. Why do I have fire? What the fuck? What the fuck? Good. Good. I mean, I've seen it all. If I'm not, like, exploding into giggle fits, it's because I've seen so very many types of corruptions for this game in particular, but... I mean, you never know. You never know, you might... There might be something amazing... ...hidden somewhere in here. One player... Like, you know, Mario dying on the title screen. This one's called Jumping Corrupts More. Yep. A fucking corrupted Bowser just came out of a question mark block, so yes, I'd say that is very accurate. Well. Yes. Yep. The, yep. Can, can we see the, the Bowser thing again? Oh, come on! <sighs> I've never been more frustrated with a corruption. There you are. Bowser- Bowser's dead? Bow Bowser was a turtle. Bowser was just a regular Koopa. Anyway, this marks the- uh, what the fuck? I'm not controlling this. I- I actually did not control that. Um, but yeah, this marks the fourth week in a row I've done corruptions. It's, it hasn't been like this in a while, but I mean, there's- there's been a lot of good stuff happening in the corruption world, so to speak. Hardware corruptors, GameCube corruptions, brand new corruptor. <laughs> All he had to do was see the fucking front of Dracula's castle. That was too much for Simon Belmont. He gave up right then and there. Oh fuck, is this Asylvania? Holy shit. If you were here in the early days, you would know that there was this fucked up corruption called Asylvania. Which was just an infinite corruption machine. This is almost that. It's fucking back. You have a video of it. Oh yeah, I think I do have a video of it. Just when you thought it was over. There it is. There's Asylvania. That's why it's called Asylvania. 
Meanwhile, all Konami has to do is release this exact thing. And they would make millions, but they're- they're busier with Pachinko, man. Castlevania Pachinko Machine confirmed. I actually figured out there was like a trick to this. When the screen turns gray, you're not okay. So I figured out that there was a trick where if you just walked a couple steps, you could get some very interesting music. on from this in a second because there are plenty of other corruptions. Ready? Whoa! Go! Shh, this is the fucking Game Boy Advance one? <laughs> oh no! Yep, it's exactly the Game Boy Advance Monkey Ball. Please, no. 15 frames a second or less. Even when it's not corrupted. Dear God. This is the ultimate Monkey Ball challenge. Where there's all this shit on the screen to distract you. Fewer. Fine. I'm like, kind of determined to complete this level at least. I, I, I can't, I can't actually do this with the controls and the frame rates being the way they are, holy fuck. Ah, god damn it. Deprive me of my victory. Oh, fuck. I, I tries desperately to fight against the black hole, the void, but succumbs to its influence nonetheless. Jesus, fuck. So this is, um, Doom for the Game Boy Advance. Little do you know, this isn't even actually corrupted. Man, everyone fucking shits on Skyrim for being ported to everything. But Doom is literally on calculator. What? Cycling through all the sound effects, but they're just getting worse. It, it sounds like a seal having a fucking intense glitchy orgasm.
It's going through miscellaneous data and converting it to audio. Is, is that's what that's what's happening? <sighs> wow. That's good stuff though. And here's the Super Nintendo version of Doom, which looks even crustier. Nice. Nice score. Man, listen to that drum. Listen to that snare drum. It sounds like Saint Anger. Uh, whoa. What the fuck? This is the calculator version of Doom. Like... How the fuck is this even in the corruptor? How how is this possible? TI eighty three. It's the TI eighty three version of Doom. Uh, I can't I can't do anything with this. It just immediately crashes. Let me reboot it. Mem cleared. I don't know if that's a good thing. Okay, I'm ready to start Doom now. I, d I wow! I had one of these fucking calculators. I used to play, um, Fall Down or something. But yeah, this is unplayable. Anyway, this is the PlayStation version of Doom. I know the resolution here is um, god awful. This is like so much better than the um, SNES version. E even corrupted, this is better than the default Super Nintendo version of Doom. I actually completed a level. Uh, so the name of this corruption is fittingly non-Euclididoom. Non-Euclididoom... ...geometry. Yeah. It's pretty good, that. Okay, so there you go. Um, you might know this game. You, you might, <laughs> you might recognize this game. Good shit. Good part of carpal effects. Good carpal tunnel syndrome. All right, Link builds speed for 12 hours. Oh. With this kind of power, Link is undefeatable. Except for what he is. What is this, Metopia? A fucking mage casts a spell on Link's sword to make it massive. Whoa, okay. <laughs> I think the sword is vibrating so fast that it's lifting him off the ground, somewhat like a helicopter.
Oh, uh, Link got raptured. I didn't. I was waiting for it. Uh, I was in Asbury Park yesterday watching the Pixies. I was like, oh, now's a good time. If I'm going to get raptured, do it now. And then I can eat the sock from wherever. Where do you go after rapture? Heaven? Reverse rapture would probably occur for me, for the likes of me, but that's okay. Reverse rapture is something like eating a sock anyway. Smash Brothers mirror mode. Nice dudes. Tone deaf dudes. Oh, it's happening here. It's happening again. Yeah, Link is 100% untouchable. And Kirby... Kirby's just a bunch of floating body parts. So this is, um, yeah, this is Smash 5. Here it is. Open the Open wings. The wing. That's a lot of wings you got there, Star Fox. What the fuck? What kind of... <laughs> Get your key diffuser system. <laughs> Link is playing the ocarina for the soundtrack. How nice of him. Falco here. I'm fine. Are you? Are you? Are you? You don't have a body. This is Peppy. All systems go. Okay, these are good N64 corruptions. Wow. Yep, the, they spin. That, that's how they do. Oh shit, it's playable. Kind of. It's like a double R wing. Like stacked. Flippy, get back here. Remember the double down from KFC? Flippy, you know, you know what I'm talking about. The, the thing that instantly kills you when you eat it. This reminds me of that. Wow, nice, good moves, Slippy. Good moves! I never saw someone pull off a reverse hover technique. We're entering Corneria City now. Good lasers. This is horrible. I I'm actually shocked that this is playable. I mean, it's 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 not that funny, but it's playable. There's upside down lasers. Ships are doing weird, fucked up things. I mean, that's that's a barrel roll right there. Amazing. Some of these controls are not bound properly. You got an enemy on your tail. Use the brake. I don't know what you want me to do, Pep. Pep secret. This one's called the penultimate part one. There's an exception. We might have to restart it. Auto kill switch stop working. So the auto kill switch function, um, it immediately crashes as soon as I load it. So there might need to be some hot fix for that. Yeah, apparently this one's going to take a while to load, but it's it's also saying core accepted the ROM, but threw an exception while loading it. So something's wrong. We're going to have to restart. It. 
use detached mode. Actually, I did. I started it in detached mode. Whatever the fuck that is. Okay. So we do this. We, we load again. I have to just load the settings. And again, there's a number of stockpiles from a, a bunch of different people that work with corruptions. Like some of the people that have submitted some of the best corruptions have submitted corruptions tonight for this brand new corruptor that finally makes N64 corruptions not only possible, but like really good. Like previous N64 corruptions were good. There were some people found some really good ones, but now I think we're going to start to see some really fucked up ones. Let's see. Hopefully the Zelda one works. Start it in Depeche mode. Okay. Phil, can you please uh, create a Depeche mode setting for this? Okay, it's loading. It's loading. Oh, okay there. Long by the garden. Am known to Steku tree. The children of the four, Kokirt, live here with me. Each Kokiri hit us as on guardian fairy. You a barber, but there's one noba who does not have a fairy. <laughs> Look at that stankiness, that stanky leg syndrome. Restless leg stanky syndrome that Link had. Oh. Alright. Apparently this was supposed to crash at Navi. If you soft lock, rewind. It would crash sometimes here and sometimes Navi. Okay, so we'll we'll load again. A core is having a problem. So it's losing its goddamn mind. <laughs> core accepted the ROM. Error during during attaching plugin Mupen sixty four plus video jabo. The tech is here. It's still not a very cohesive streaming experience, though. A lot of restarts and stuff, which is no fault of anyone involved. It's just a really difficult thing to do. All right, start auto kill switch. Just that immediately crashes. Well, I'm doing a live, I'm doing a live play test. Classic Jabbo. Ruining corruptions. That son of a bitch. Okay, so then I restart, and then I think the BizHawk settings have reset. Possibly. Which isn't good. Let's see what happens here. A core accepted the ROM, but blah, 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 blah. Can't do the thing. Fuck off. The settings don't re <laughs> reset. Okay. Yes, I've noticed that. So I have to reload settings. This could take a little while. I'm going to save config. You, you don't, I don't need to reload them. Okay. Well, hang on.
um, if it's if I don't need to reload them, then it should just work. So this is, you know, I give a disclaimer every corruption stream that this is bound to happen. And that you shouldn't expect a flawless streaming experience. Okay, something's going on here. Something's working. Nope. Part two and three don't work either, Neri. Actually, nothing's working now. Good shit. There you go. Okay. Thanks, Wario. Thank you for shitting out of your asshole real quick so that everyone could be entertained. Okay, I'm restarting everything. Going back into the launcher, trying again. I feel like I should have some elevator music just to keep you, you know, keep you a little entertained. Are you not entertained? All right, let's see. Stockpile. I'll load again. I don't think the, um, I don't think the Zelda corruptions are going to end up working. That's my theory. Oh, it really restarted everything. Okay, that's weird. Um, huh. Okay, it, it restarted like everything, everything. So now I have to reload my uh, files, my stockpiles. Vinny gets frustrated and troubleshoots the stream. everyone. Just a little bit more patience while I attempt to get this N64 corruptions to work. One day, one day there will be a smooth corruption experience. Today is not that day. a little something. I had to go through many steps to get this to work. Many Bothan spies perished for this. Oh, Nava. The... We're... The Bry? The Fabry. Licks into my words, the words of the Deku Tree. R.A. R.N. shows... R&D shows that the scent... I don't... I can't even read that. Malevolent forces are mustering to ack our... our land. Fought so long, the Cockery Forest. Cockery Forest. How do you pronounce bar 
analog stick ear. Tremendo. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hello. It's when the fuck did Kokiri Village turn into a fucking beach? Link is now just boots. Hello. <laughs> oh, okay. Hello, me man. Wake him up. The Riot Deku Tro wants to talk to you, me man. Eat up. I said eat up! We gotta fatten you up. Come on! Can Hyrule's destiny really do end on X such a 3AZ boy? The music just gave up. Uh, yaku tre the yaku tree tray asked me to be your partner from now on Nazi to meet you Jesus fuck the great Deku tree has bisumon what the fuck is this text what a horrendous horrendous story this game has I don't like it That's the thing. People always said, don't play Zelda for- what the hell? Link awakens to the sound of music. <laughs> for the record, I like Ocarina of Time's story. You know, like... There's a couple people like, Vinny, you don't like Zelda's story? I do. I don't like this story. I can't figure it out. I'm trying real hard to understand what's going on. I got nothing. Wow, a fiery. Finally, a fairy came to you, me man. Wait, are you get going? G Gossy the Great Deku Tree. That's the best instrument. Oh my god. The music just got satanic. It's an incantation ritual. Finally, the return of Satan and corruptions. You know, I've been a big advocate for the return of Satan to the corruption world. Oh, the something came to see you equals now. It's somewhat stable. Wow. Just as I say that, we go to fucking Terminal 11. All right, well, this house is silly. The sound of music fills my ears. Good, 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 good text. I'm all about that. That many Mido made cut memento memento the Mido told Saria he you. No one's me. I'm me. Oh oh, old do it so she would like him, but to one to don't want to work. 
You and Saraya are close A friends. So will you help me cut the Nakaz? Silly. Silly conversation for a silly Kokiri. I can't I can't even I can't press the button anymore. He you. can't reload the thing. I mean, it's, it's a good corruption, but now now we get back to the the stress of the corruptor not doing what I wanted to do. Rewind if it gets stuck. Well, this is what's happening now if, if Air Cluzar needs to see what's happening. So, that's, uh, that happened just as I tried to reload the corruption. Something tells me it's going to be Kind of a pain in the ass to get that one started again, so I might... I mean, I guess I sh I guess I, I should go see the Deku tree. I thought about it for a second. I think you guys need a little bit of, uh, you need a little help. I just noticed that you needed the, the duck button. Okay, Meme Man is here. I need to go see the Great Deku Tree. <laughs> Alright. Oh wait, don't you need a sword and shield to do this? Equals now. Well, wait, maybe I could just like run through Mido. You're but not allowed to leave the forest. Oh wait, no, no, no. That's that's how you leave the forest. Just glitch past it. I would love to glitch past it, but I don't know if I can. Hey you, Mr. No Fairy, what's your busy ass wit? Can't talk to this dude. Every fucking time I try to talk to this dude. Wow, I rewound really far. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to say fuck the Deku Tree, and we'll just keep going. Again, there's a lot more corruptions to get to. There's a lot more stream to get to. However, this is a really good start to N64 corruptions. Like, if, if they're gonna end up like this, playable, and this fucked up, then that's a good thing. Oh, here's Wario pissing garlic out of his ass again. So, the name of this corruption is Anxiety. The previous one was called Stress. This one's called Dopamine. G G 
Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. This one's called Panic. Holy shit. Holy fuck. Mario's going Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan? Super Saiyan? How do you say it? This one's called Destruction. Where's the destruction? Jeez. And this one's called acceptance. I am not sad to see these corruptions go away. Fucking hell. Okay, this is... F <laughs> this is a collection of Mario 64 corruptions from Wienerless Steve. I, I hope they work. I really hope they work to the point that I can just play them and not have to fuck with any settings. Now, this is not Mario 64 Nightmare Edition, which will be up later. This one's called Trust No One, Not Even Yourself. There's a lot of ba bombs here. Um, okay, hang on a minute. I think I might need to uh, rebind some controls. B. Okay. Trust no one, not even yourself. Seems kind of okay to me. Everything in its wrong place. Yep. Oh, read the notes? Okay. Exploring the whole map in ones like these. Lots of subtle things wrong. Okay. Here, I'll go back to the first one. I mean, there's, you know, so certain things are not supposed to be here. I'm aware of that. Jeez. Like... Okay, for example... Alright, just, just for example... There should not be this many babams here! <laughs> Alright? There should not be this many Koopa the Quicks here. Okay, you can't even race Cooper the Quick. Can't wall jump here for some reason. Yeah, the game does not know how to process Koopa the Quick being over there. Also, is it just me or is the fucking Chain Chomp a little too close to the road? Oh, dude, no, 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 no. Don't go. Absolutely not. I don't want you to crash my fucking game. Now, this is really Babam Battlefield. I believe this. I believe that this is where the Babams live. Like, you don't see enough of them usually, but now it's like, oh, yeah, Babam Battlefield, they live here. There's plenty of peaceful Babams just hanging out. 
They're upset because their kingdom has been corrupted. See, now I'm looking for things that are wrong. Okay, a bomb just fell off that ledge. Just died. I'm sorry, what? Uh, sound effect there. Just doing some reading. There's now an. Uh, whoa! Oh, oh my God! Oh my God! <laughs> Are we cool? We cool. I think we cool. Also, just one second. It's in Hang on, it's in plugins. Let's see if we can get the resolution a little higher here. It's not working. Alright, never fucking mind then. No. No! No! <laughs> the bridge. <laughs> the bridge. <laughs> the fucking bridge. Maybe we can just go through there? No. Signs, signs, everywhere the signs. Fucking up the scenery, breaking my mind. Mario reverts to baby. Oh, um, wow. That's interesting. That is certainly interesting. What the fuck are you even doing here, mate? It's just boxes all over the place. It's just random boxes in random spots. Is... What is that? Oh, it's, uh... Oh, I guess it was a one-up. Oh, okay. I love this new corruptor. Mostly. <laughs> this is Koopa the Quick. Koopa the Stone. And now that's about the right spot from the road. I 
might just want to watch from up here. What Thwomp the Quick, Thwomp the Super Fast looks like. Alright, where is he? There he is! There he is! Thwomp the Almighty Fast. Jesus. That is good stuff. You done fucked up. Even though now I'm inside you. Just absolutely disgusting. Here we go. Oh, what the fuck? So this is Koopa the Quick now. What the fuck are you? Holy shit! It's a dark Goomba. But it's darker than the other Goombas! Holy shit. Everything's... Everything's totally fucked. Yet... Yet, it's playable. I have 168 stars, by the way. I don't know if anyone caught that. A full 168. there? Wow, you're, you're just there. You are just there. You have been relocated. Not here. But there. This one's called Super Mario 65. Try picking up a box. Wow, oh, oh my god. I'm supposed to pick up a box. Oh! Oh! Trust no one! Not even yourself! The only way you get better is if you race a deformed clone version of yourself, Luigi. That's the only way you can really, really be the best you can ever be, my Luigi. That's what I mean, Mario. I mean, I don't know who I am anymore. Stuck in here. supposed to be on this level. Nice cow sound effects. <laughs> Blown into the great abyss. You've got bigger problems than feeding your baby. Or finding your baby. Yes, you do! You don't have a fucking head! Multiple penguin mothers looking for their babies. And again, this isn't the level that they're supposed to be on, so it's just... It's a wonder that they got over here. Yeah, too bad I got this star already. <laughs> 
you know, having all 168 stars in Mario 64, of course. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, what? I did not go back in. I did not. Yeah, into the igloo, sure. It's just a fucking ball. As, as Mario's fabric of being is torn apart, a ball harasses him. Also, this is the origin of Finna Boing. Just saying. Finna Boing. See? There it is! Mario, I don't, I don't know if it's okay that you're going back to all these levels years later. Things have changed, Mario. Things have changed. You've changed. I'm still the same plumber I've always been, Louis. Mario, you haven't been a plumber in 30, 34 years. Oh, I finally did it. I finally got past that fucking part that I couldn't get past. And, and now I don't... And now I don't know where I am anymore. What? <laughs> this music got good! <laughs> Mamma mia! Luigi, I haven't been a plumber since the 80s! The 80s, Luigi! Oh, oh, excuse me, I had a little bit of sriracha. itself. My stomach, that is. Yeah, no, the music fixed itself. What are you? What are you? Come on, time to the tent. Come on now. It's time to go. It's time to die! It's time to die in the Mario! I hear a strange noise in the distance. Could... It's Yoshi on the roof. He's kind of farting. Very farty footstep sound. Oh, now it's okay. Kind of. is Mario Goes to Vietnam, by the way. Some, oh! Some slightly modified sound effects. Mario has become a chipmunk. Random dudes of sound. 
Even though I have 168 stars, I've never been through any of these doors. Oh, first time I've ever been to this level. One's simply entitled Highbrow. <laughs> Indeed. Headcase? Accurate titles! I'm sorry. Oh. Oh no. It's like arse face from fucking Preacher, please, God. Okay. Goodbye, Mario. Nice knowing you. It's called Massive Wood. Um, yep, that's that's Massive Wood. Uh, it crashes. Getting too close to one of the objects crashes the game. Take the low path all the way to the top. That's so we just can't get close to the wood. can't actually get this to work. Let's see if I go up here. The dirt path? Oh, it's too late now. I'm up here. Oh my god. Why is there so many? Fuck! There's an exceptionally large amount of piranha plants. Okay, that crashed. Let's restart. Uh, I might have to resize this window. No, we're good. It's a black bar at the top, but I'm sure you can deal with that. This one's called Family Vacation. Okay. So, whatever corruption was previously... Oh, look, it's just a star. Just there. Good for me. <laughs> I recovered! Very good. Ah! Oh. oh, I forgot I have rewind. Multiple. What the fuck? No. 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 <laughs> no, stop talking to me. Cooper the Quicks with no shells. Truly, this is the newest field of Coopers. Also, they have, like, babies with them. You notice that? There's, like, like baby Coopers. This is, like, Pond of Coopers. Oh, I just punched a Cooper in the face and it's dead. I'm, I'm killing their babies. So many of them, too. Okay. 
Okay, here's the <laughs> Oh, it would make sense that this would be the boss, wouldn't it? I guess I just have to pretend I'm fighting the thwomp still. It's good. Coin chaos. Alright, so I have to find the bully. Nice fucking slide puzzle. Wow. Yeah, this is good. That is good. At least they reward you well for attempting the challenge. There's a fuckload of coins over there. There's a lot of one-ups over here. Uh, hello. Can, can we fight? Um, yeah, someone who, who asked in chat, does this thing support higher resolution? I tried to get it into a higher resolution, but for some reason it's not working. It's weird. Normally it does. Normally I can get it into a higher resolution, but... Reboot the core. Oh, there you go. That should help a little bit. Alright. Now it looks a little bit better. Okay, so, uh, this one also says... Alright, oh uh, no, this one's good. This one's called, It Makes Me So Mad. What? Jesus fuck, I know you're n you're mad, I know! Who are you? But... I'm fucking massive, how did I die? Holy shit. I'm still massive. <laughs> I mean, what kind of mutagen did Mario take? Mario, I think your mushrooms were laced! I think- I think someone put something on them, Mario! PCP! Doing drugs. Nice. What have I done? I've squished myself. I won? I think the- Wait, I think the bully just, like, jumped into the lava by himself? <laughs> Wait a minute, I don't know what happened. I think the bully killed himself, the star appeared, and then I died. Whoa. Some, some cool sound effects. <laughs> that was a cry for help. <laughs> I couldn't hear the rest of it. It was just Mario going, Mrr. Some platforms extend for... ever. The 
worst part is having to be stared at while dying. Mamma mia! Beard stash. This one's called the Drowning Orchestra. That sounds pretty good. The Mario Odyssey remix of this song is very good. Quality. was a different Mario. That was Shadow Mario, by the way. Just just in case you were wondering. Oh. It's either a surfboard or Mario's eye has mutated. That looks extremely painful. Even in a cartoony game. This is called Terminal 8. Yep. <laughs> yep! <laughs> Mario is like a mouse! Beckons. The cold shoulder. He doesn't give a fuck about any of us. He never cared. We bought his games for years. We gave him so much of our love, so much attention. We gave Nintendo so much of our money. Mario never cared. So this one's called Psychedelic Wonderland, and uh, this isn't the first time we've had a corruption called Psychedelic Wonderland. But I think it's probably the most accurate thus far. I mean, down to the music, which is more or less the same- oh, what the fuck? Can I see you up close? Oh, you don't need wings. Man. Man, when you can fly, and you can really fly and let your spirit free, man, you can do an anything. Mario tries a new kind of mushroom. <laughs> Some nice, uh, nice Scooby tunes. Lovely tunage. Love, lo lovely tunage. What the fuck? Let me get up there. Come on. Okay. All right. I give up. What the fuck? Yeah, this is a new level of N64 corruptions. There should... 
I, I've never seen a corruption import a cannon onto the slide. Major Tom to ground control. Major Tom to ground control. Jeez, come on! Ah, oh, let me. Oh, oh. A carnival funhouse slide. Uh, God damn it, just as I was about to get a new record. I sang it backwards on purpose because Mario was stranded and he needed to contact ground control. Get it? It was bad. Don't worry about it. But wait a minute, doesn't Bowie say Major Tom to ground control at some point in the song? Isn't that part of the lyrics? Like it reverses intentionally. Anyway, Super Doom 64, this one's called. Oh my god. Yeah. I still got it wrong. Okay. Alright, never mind then. I still got it wrong. This is nausea inducing. This is... Mamma mia. <laughs> this is interesting. <laughs> oh, fuck. Just before the last one, too. There's one more corruption for Mario 64, and I just... I just crashed. I beansed it. Well, there is a point where he says Major Tom to ground control, but he apparently says... He doesn't say it twice. He says uh, something else after that. Oh, wait, no. There's a couple more corruptions. There's not one more. There wasn't just one more. <laughs> the name of this corruption is Balther. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hang on now, this is another issue, because I just set the, the resolution to be a bit higher. And now I have to reset, and as soon as there's a crash, it's me, Mario. a lot of work has to be done. Doesn't look like the resolute resolution. Yeah, a little bit. I hate Balther. Flat Mario versus Balther. Holy shit. <laughs> what language is this? Jesus Christ, you are long. Or rather, wide. I hesitate to say the word thick. Figures I would get that. My actual playthrough, I fucked it up so many times. Oh, this is a sight for this is this is a diorama. <laughs> Is um, very lanky. Very lanky. I, 
I don't even know what to say. This is amazing. And again, by accident, I just defeated Bowser. Even the swollest Bowser can be defeated. That is nice. Mario really does take after Lanky Kong. Yeah, look at that low poly Mario. There's there he is, there's Maro. We haven't seen Maro in a while. Take a look at them polygons. Fixing it. Fixed. Just in case you couldn't tell, this- <laughs> Mario was d basically flexing the entire time. I'll rewind so you can see the celebration. I think it's kind of worth it. Good. Just showing off his arms. I don't know if that's natural. I think, um, I think Mario's been injecting saline into his arms. This is illegal. The video games committee is gonna come down hard on Mario. Using illegal substances for performance enhancement. Huge fan of this remix. Wow. That's actually really good. Sky. And again! Oh, that, that time I died. Jump into the painting, pick any star. The all-seeing eye is found on the left side of the spinning platform. This is the final one of this collection. So it seems like a kind of a normal eye, almost a little bit. Oh, it's connected to me, man. But I'm invincible, so... Oh, there- oh, there it is. This is the real all-seeing eye. Okay, um... It's getting kind of late, and I still have a lot of corruptions. Uh, I might... Continue with the corruption, so then I can do Mario Nightmare Edition. And then 
the thick thing. I don't know if the Sonic stuff is going to happen tonight. I might have to. I might have to come back to that because there's just way too much stuff to get to, and I want to test these new corruptions. So let's see. Let's see how much more I can get through, and we'll take it from there. So uh, I have classic NES corruptions. These we could probably get through kind of quick. And then I have some corruptions that unfortunately don't work very well. And that was the problem. It was VGDC's stockpile. They didn't quite work. Don't know why. But we can go through some of the ones there that do work. Vinny, do you have an NES Classic Edition to corrupt? No. How, how would I even corrupt that? I'd have to... I'd have to ship that off to Grant and have him reverse engineer it and then make a hardware corruptor for it. New Hawk. Okay, so some of these work. Some of them don't. We'll do the ones that work. There's there's only a couple here anyway, so. Like, um... Like this one. Infinite titties and bubble bobble. Fire and Donkey Kong. Wow. Whoa, my God! Did you hear that fucking scream? What? Is, what is this hellscape? What is this? What the fuck is this? What? What is this? I don't remember that being in Mario 64. I was like, he's like, oh. 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 I can't believe. No, this has got to be. This has got to be a mod. This has got to be a mod. There's no way Mario makes that sound. Oh. It is a mod. It's confirmed to be a mod. It's the Oni mod. Pipe engine doesn't work. Vector engine on Conquer. Yeah, this is kind of a mess. But yeah, that's that's what it's supposed to look like. It's just tiny Conquer. some settings but uh oh, floating floating gun okay got these fucking frame rates please good okay well we, we've seen that one more crashing oh there's more crashing Vinny, any plans to stream this game someday? I did. If you go to YouTube and type Vine Sauce Conquer, you should be able to find it. I streamed Conquer, I think, a year and a half ago or so. 
anyway, um, I'm not even going to bother with VGs because they just crash. They're not reliably um, consistent. So... That said, I do have some good classic NES corruptions, and then we can check out uh, one one more set of corruptions with Mario 64, where it's just a live nightmare edition, which is, in essence, live corruptions showcasing that this thing can corrupt on the fly and have it still be playable. That's my understanding of what we're going to do. But I do have some stuff here. That may be of interest. Let me get rid of this. Okay. But yeah, this corruptor's cool. It needs work. A, a couple of a couple of bug fixes and it would be good. And these corruptions are from Frustrator. Good, good. All right, let's begin. A slower, darker Metroid. And harder. It appears missiles only go one way. Uh, hang on a minute, I need to get some volume out of this because we have no volume. better. Oh man. So many settings that I like I, I get and then they go away. The settings do not save. It's very frustrating. Okay. I had no idea the morph ball was to the left and through a door. Oh, okay. So when you save config, that's all well and good until... Hang on a minute. Until you have to load someone else's configuration, and then it's kind of beans again. Alright. Uck. Uggk. Music generator. I mean, fucking Metroid didn't age well, but this is- this is a new fucking level. DJs, though, would continue to use the Metroid game for years to come to create sick new bi uh, riffs and beats. I was gonna say biffs. Which is kind of a riff beat. We're, we're getting close to the, like, this is- this is really, what, like, the type of music that- that's popular. Like a couple more years, and we're gonna have retro synth, retro, retro glitch pop, punk. This one's called Super Metroid Run. Okay, okay, I get to shoot Samus's. That's cool. Backwards doors. And yeah, for the record, Samus is running on her own. That was pretty quick. It went from pretty okay to failure in just a couple seconds. Good corruption. The game shits itself. <clears throat> yeah, I think we're there already.
Now, yeah, this this is where the epilepsy warnings come in, obviously. Much like the sun, you shouldn't look at this directly. Maybe, maybe use your peripherals. You're not missing anything, trust me. The fuck is this? Duh. Robin Thick was a goddamn fucking prophet making NES games back in the 80s. The Lego the Legood of Elda. Many Yanars ago Prance Darkness Ginton swole <laughs> one of the Triforce Zith power. Again. Oh man, fucking Ginton was one of the worst villains in Zelda history, though. I was always hoping they would bring Ginton back for at least one. Dinosaur music. All right. Okay, so this is very minimal, almost Atari-like graph- okay. Frog off, oh wait. Hi he ho. Frog off, ha la to ho. Frog off, ha la ha ho. Frog off, ha la ha ho. Take this on you go. Yeah, the AI in this game kind of sucks, I don't know if you noticed that. They just kind of move away from Link. Whatever direction Link is facing, they run away. <laughs> Don't know what that means. Please enlighten me, what's Tearfall? Is that the new Elder Scrolls game? Elder Scrolls 5. Or what are we up to? Doesn't matter. 10. Terrorfall. Yeah, enemies are extremely predictable in this version. The Atari version of Zelda was a lot easier. Just the important things. You don't need to know anything else. Here it is. Stripped down to its most essential elements. Ganon Triforce, Zelda Triforce. Eight Ganon, go find the eight units linked to save her. Oh, oh, I... I can make things happen by pressing buttons. I like that half moon, <clears throat> the half moon item. I've never seen it in Zelda, but I'd like it. Some say the half moon is the most powerful of all the artifacts, second only to the Triforce. And then, well, third to the Biforce. Fourth to the Bi Horse. Um, there's a lot wrong here. Ten taster. 
Wow, wow, yeah, there's a, there's a whole lot wrong here. These are, even the NES corruptions are fucking quality with this new corruptor. Look at this. This is fucking great. So we have um, Ammo Force. We pick up the Ammo Force, which is basically bomb testicles, as far as I'm aware. Double bomb testicles. It's a no sword run, but we get double bomb testicle. Great! Oh, we get double rupee. Oh, never mind. They're just single rupee. Mitpur 12 has till 11. I think they're speaking in code. They're trying to communicate through some kind of code. Some rudimentary- Oh my god! Please! Make it clean! The Darkest Years of Vine Sauce is the name of this corruption. But yeah. Yep. Nice dark nut human centipede, by the way. I don't know what the fuck you want from me, old man, but allow me to at least give you the sweet release of death. The most precious gift I could give to someone, such as yourself. Stuck in a dungeon. You know, he lost his faculties. This is what happens in, when you're in an old, moldy, crusty, rotted dungeon. Your brain starts to go funny. You start saying strange things. Ain't that right, cool? No. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, never mind. My whole train of thought is thrown off by a sentient fucking corruption. I didn't know this new corruptor could create sentient living corruptions that could respond to my queries. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, he named the, the he named Link Binyet. These controls are fucking horrendous. Why are you guys bringing back Rickrolling? Why does my chat keep bringing the Rickroll back? Why you guys do this? I know it's a sick meme, but but still. Well, let's make it worse. go. Blarg. It says Blarg. <laughs> Dr. Floppy! There you go, I made the bad man go away. Shit, he's back. I'm going to Emmanuel blast him into oblivion. Alright, this one's pretty cool. This is me now getting dick lolled.
<laughs> Never gonna give you a song. Ah, yes, the classic Sonic the Hedgehog on the NES Entertainment System. The Nintendo Entertainment System Entertainment System. So you got your shitty Sonic tonight? Pikachu. Um, we've reached some kind of ninth circle of hell. That looks like a crevasse. That looks like a sex crevice. I don't know if that's allowed on Twitch. from Tom Tom. Yeah. Yeah, gotta get fucked. Yeah. Oh. Oh. I'm afraid of heights. Sh shit. Shit. This is the Master System version? It says NES. I think this is- this is actually a- This is a bootleg of Sonic on the NES. This, it says it right here that the system is NES. Gotta wear a diaper! Oh! Sonic is past. <sighs> Moment of silence, please. We'll always remember you, Sonic. This, this is getting a little bit uncomfortable. Rise of a new hero. Sonic may have passed, but we have... Somari. The legendary. His name is Somari, guys. It's- it's not Somali. It's not Grand. 
It's not an uncle. It's not a dad. It's nothing like that. It's Somari. Alright, now, let's go back to classic Mario Brothers. You know, no nothing weird here. The old tried and true. Never mind the glitchy Goombas. Everything here is fine. Just going through level one. World one, one. World one, one. Everything here is fine. Nothing to worry about. It's okay. Just have to pass the Great Barrier to get to the exit pipe. Or, or you could... Or you could take the shortcut, which I unfortunately missed. The, um... Huh. For some reason, there's no rewind on this one. I guess the settings changed, and... Frustrator uses a different rewind button. What's your rewind button, Frustrator? It's not on the keyboard. It's not bound to the controller. Oh well. Turn on a dime. <laughs> y and X on the Xbox controller. Okay, those aren't... No. They're bound to something else now. Alright, well, I'd have to rebind it. I'm, I'm not gonna do that because I'm not gonna be doing these for too much longer before we go to Nightmare Edition, and then Thick. One Oreo. You can never just have one Oreo, you know? I mean, what's the deal with one Oreo? It's a kind of an interesting version of Mario. Get to swim and shoot fire, like this. It's like a whole nother game. It's like a whole new experience. Oh, shit. There's even bullet time, like the Matrix. The Great Jape is the name of this one. Wario 1. I understand the Jape now. The greatest of Japes. Bowser's always waiting for you. This one's called Smart Steering. I have no control over Mario right now. That's cool. I mean Luigi. I, I, wait, I mean Mario, I think? Thank fucking god I can go through pipes at least. <laughs> this is really nice! I cannot swim. I'm wearing lead boots. Pipe PUs. Wow. I need to pick up Mario's shoulder to get big. Oh yeah, I see what you mean now. We've entered a parallel dimension. I'm 
dead. This one's called Super Mario Properties. I wish I could have started earlier so we had more time for activities. I might, um... I might figure out something this week, or maybe go a little extra next Sunday, but... Yeah, a lot of troubleshooting. A lot of troubleshooting today. Oh, I have 63 lives, I'll be fine. I'm also Ori. So, a character that would show up, like, 25 years later. Twenty twenty. Hmm. This corruption is unstable. Try slowing down for best results. Time fun. Whatever you say, man. Adventures of Duck. Why are these called duck corruptions? I don't- I don't see the duck. Am I supposed to be seeing ducks? That's an oddly specific amount of points for that. That was like 2,034 points. It's Duck Hunt. I mean, it's Duck Hunt minimally. There might be some textures. Well, not some tech. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. That's what the 2020 is all about. So, some of the... That looks like poop. That just looks like poop. So, it has elements of Duck Hunt within, but it's not fully Duck Hunt. Like, you don't have a fully formed duck available. Okay, now this is much more ducky. Doesn't really work. Holy shit. I need someone to do a remix of this. Move. Gotta be quick. Gotta be quick if you're gonna hunt ducks. Can't fuck around. Can't wait. Duckos are available. Two duckos. <laughs> Fucking flappy bird. Never mind. Procedural levels. This one says, try rewinding. It can generate levels differently. And so it's procedurally generated Mario Brothers. This is World 1-1. One, one. You, you fuck this, fuck this right up. Right away. 
This is, like, infinite worlds, Mario Brothers. I always wanted new levels. I guess I finally got my wish. Oh, I'm not dead. Wait, I don't know, Imakuni. Will we ever find Fanoth? Been searching for seven long years! This... This could be Fanoth. No, it's not. It's... No. No, we're just... We're just walking into a pipe endlessly. Never mind. Rewind is backslash. So, let's see. Well, let's try this again. New level. New pipe. Kind of boring. No enemies. Can't even go down pipes because they're halved. I mean, I don't know, this version of Mario Brothers kind of sucks. It's like no one tested it for fun. I think I'd rather play the TI-83 version, though. Like, the Doom on the TI-83 looks like poop. The Mario Brother on the TI-83 is also poop. Trust me, I tried it. It really is just generating levels on the fly. I have no idea how something like this could could occur. But here it is. Little smatterings of coins and scenery. Gonna run out of time. I guess the best we could hope for is a flagpole. Need a flagpole. Sixty-five. Oh, God damn it. Castle. Suddenly castle. Man, I would have loved this corruption when I was a kid. I would have played this endlessly looking for new worlds. Doc. Doc, you gotta find new worlds, Doc. Come on. Dog, these levels suck. Alf. There it is, there's a flagpole. I need it. Give me that, give me that flagpole. Yes! With 16 seconds and dead. Okay, I have a little guide here. I want to do this thing. I want to do this Mario thing real quick. Before, uh, before I finish off with Thick. Which, you know what it is, probably. But it's, it's a sequel. Okay, so now this is... Well, 
you'll see in a second. So there's been a lot of Mario 64 tonight. And that's usually not a problem. I'm always okay with that. One of my favorite games to corrupt, or rather to watch become corrupted. And through using this new corruptor, we can have it corrupt on the fly and still be stable. So that's what I'm, I, you know, to the best of my understanding and knowledge, that's what happens. So we can better resolution. Mario's back. It's me, Mario. There we go. Mario has logged in. Hello. It says. Enter the castle, come back outside. Okay, here we go. So, this will be, in just a moment, Mario 64 Nightmare Edition. Enter the castle, come back. Controls are all fucked. Man, I love having to reset the controls. Just a second. All right, so once again, this should be something like Chaos Edition, but maybe even a little bit better. I just, I'm not sure. Okay, now I can play the game. Good. Okay, enter castle. Go back outside. Great. So we'll make a save shift plus F1. Click on easy start. Start with recommended settings, then play the game. So that's it. That it's that simple. Okay, Mario's losing polygons. The, the world is being torn apart. This is all being done, like, procedurally. Biggity bomb bomb on the summit. Oh my god, some really intense dudes. I'm stuck. I'm, I'm stuck. It's Mario's emotions. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay! We're huge! We're, on, we're going through the level, we're huge, everything's wrong. It, it's more or less unplayable. Definitely more unplayable than less. Yeah, at least those fucking horns are gone. Small mercies. I don't know how I'm- I don't know how I just did that, but I did that. sure have come a long way. I'm having another control issue, though. What was the... I think I have to unbind the movement 
real quick. Let's see if that works. Yeah, now I have true analog control. Good. Just a ball. Just a just a ball in here. I, br I brought you a present for your dog. It's a ball. Dogs love balls, Douglas. <laughs> Mr. Dink, I thought you were a dead meme. Why the fuck do you keep coming back? I got nothing better to do, you asshole. Wow. I, I know, we, we we initiated the challenge already a couple times. You can stop now. Okay, he's devolved into, like, just growling noises. He's like... Rrr, rrr, rrr. Feet? I think I saw the word feet in there. This... this... <laughs> You're scaring me, Big Babum. <laughs> All right, well, yeah, it was a little fucked. Let's try again. This time, let me enable a couple more settings. This might actually become unplayable very quickly. <laughs> I told you it was a bad idea. It's too scary in there. I mean, this, this is what Bowser should have done. When he took over Peach's castle. He should have just left the door either locked or heavily guarded or like booby trapped it. Mamma mia. Yeah. This is good. There's like a like a couple of like you know pointed sticks right there in front of the do door. Huh. Guess we'll give it a couple of manual blasts. Wow, <laughs> the birds got really loud. Yo, I- I just... Like, I- I just raised the corruption intensity to, like... A hundred and fifty thousand... For a couple of seconds. And it, it made things kind of weird, but most notably, the birds got EXTREMELY LOUD AND SO DID THE BUTTERFLIES GET REALLY BIG! And somehow it's not crashing. Somehow this thing is still mo- oh, well... I'm not, but somehow this is still running. I wish I could swim like the dolphins. Game over. <laughs> no. <laughs> No. Okay, now I've crashed it. No, now I've done done it. Quack. 
trying real hard real hard to uh I'm just stuck in like a corruption loop here <laughs> like fucking just stop okay good Yeah, that was. Well, auto kill switch doesn't work for me. That was an attempt at auto kill switch, but the new auto kill switch does not work for some reason. I'm having some struggle with that. Okay, let's um, let's do a couple more of these. Birds are really loud again, and this time even more obnoxious. Died for your sins. Again, this is all happening real time. It's very easily controllable. It's amazing. So these aren't corruptions that someone sent me. These are all just... <laughs> That's a good noise. back to um, a different language entirely. Was that a star? Was that like a massive star in the distance? I, I guess we'll never know now. I corrupted the world away. Back in here. <laughs> okay, so uh, what I'm doing is as soon as I get in, I hit it really hard with the corruptions. And then I lower it and see if it works still. And it it, it is! Wow. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the star right there. is this thin layer of darkness. It's 
kind of amazing. It's not getting corrupted any further. Oh, wait, I take that back. It absolutely is. So, wait, wait a minute. These balls found a spot to go down and then react to environment down here. And the physics is still intact. Where'd this coin come from? Where, is there supposed to be coin? Oh yeah, there there is supposed to be coin. But it, why is one really flat and long and the other one is more or less fine? I don't understand corruptions. I never will. Just blows my mind. Corrupt is on, and so this time we get one really, really long tree. Just one! All the other trees are fine. One really long tree, the sign's a little fucked. Did you hear that? Did someone just scream? Climb the tree. Okay, well, here's another good feature. Rewinding. Rewinding is doable. Okay, so... Thin, long tree. I knew it. I knew he'd be able to climb it. That's a, uh, that's a shame. How about this? Reverse tree. Teleport tree. Get down there. Yes, I can! Just sounds like a sad animal. Alright, this is a good joke. You, you can get me out of here now. Too many banjo players in this band, and, and they just wanted to be mixed really loudly. There's an obnoxious banjo player in the studio who's like, listen, I need to be up front. I'm the star of this band. The engineer just gave up. It's like, Fuck it, pulled the plug on the whole recording. Yep, there you go. 
frozen. I'm sure there's more specific ways to get very pointed corruption results. I haven't figured that out, but just using the system as it is... ...and just letting it do its thing... ...is amazing. So again, this is not a ROM hack. This has nothing to do with cheats or Game Genie codes like the previous Chaos Edition that I did. Um, that Nintendo didn't like very much. What a surprise. Uh, this is, this is just glitches. This is just... Glitches. Lots of them, and in a row. the best way I can explain it. So Nintendo, if your lawyers are watching, please understand. Please understand that this is in fact not a ROM hack. Okay, so here's my plan. The intensity is on 101. I'm gonna try to get one star. At least one star. So, auto-corrupt is on. It's gonna just continue going through corruption cycles until things get more and more toasty. Like that. That is very, very not good. Already boned. What the fuck? I just started, Bowser. Yep, Mario's a baby. No wonder Bowser is, is so imposing for Mario. Beautiful sound effects. What? Please. Please. Yeah, they call him Long Coin Johnson. The longest coin that ever lived. Okay, that was the Vector engine. Well, let me see if anything happens with the Nightmare engine. Good. Nightmare Engine is not working out. <laughs> you can see, you can see it doesn't, it doesn't really have, doesn't really have any stability. It just mirrors Mario like really, really small. Like, like, baby size. Like, how did you get so small, baby? You're like a baby small. So yeah, Mario can uh, decrease with the power of the Nightmare Engine. Um, and that's just another way of corrupting. I have, again, I have no idea how this works. I'm gonna pretend like I know what I'm talking about, but I really don't.
pipe engine. Hey, uh, Air Cluzar, are there any other engines I could be using for better... for better corruptions? Like the pipe engine? Okay, the vector engine absolutely works. This is the vector engine. It can do stuff like this. No, not really. So the vector is the, the main one. Okay. Just checking. God damn it. Ducking crashes. Vector engine was developed just for this. Okay. Well, we're in a an en endless loop of, of crashing. And every time BizHawk loads, it just crashes again. <laughs> so I don't know what the hell's going on here. Uh, okay. All right, we're, we're, we're quacking. We are quacking. All right, great. Uh, I guess that's about it. I don't really know if there's anything else I could be doing here. How about this? I'll try one more random N64 game and just see what happens. So I'm going to load up something that we haven't seen tonight. Something random from my collection of terrible games and good ones. And uh, okay, there's there's one game I'm thinking of in particular that I haven't seen corrupt very well ever. This game has always been very difficult to corrupt. So. Let us begin. So something's happening. Oh god, it's it whatever whatever it is, it's happening too much. Please stop. Hard reset. Banjo is crashy as fuck. Okay, never mind. That that exp that explains that. Some games just don't just don't agree with um with corruptions. Okay. Turn corruptions off. Maybe, maybe we can get to the intro. Okay. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I'll just start a game. And, uh... Here we go. Let's, let's see. It'll probably crash, but... I'll just throw some random blasts at it. Oh my god. Uh... <laughs> I'm actually shocked this is kind of working. When I say kind of working... Oh! God! Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Fuck! Nice T-pose. Such nice music Grant Kirkhope composed for this game. Oh. 
hide there. Holy shit. That fucking noise. I'm gonna try to get a little further this time, and then... And then I'll hit the, uh, the warp engine. Yeah, that was terrifying. That was absolutely terrifying. Grunty doing there? <laughs> they lost some furniture. Nothing's happening. Oh my god. There we go. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yep. Yep. Extra long. Extra wide. But just her. Okay, now, now she's more fucked up. <laughs> There's an inconsistency here. Yeah, Banjo crashes a lot. But you can get a couple good things out of it. It's some stuff. Like that. Like that. Hither. That's the game's cue to crash on the Hither. Tootie. Tootie, you're, you're upside down. You're not the mole bottles is. And thus, Grunty filled the world with a poison cloud. That would choke every living being out of existence. A much more efficient plan. Wh where did Banjo go? Ban Banjo just got real thin. surprised it did not it didn't survive the transition over there that is amazing there's uh, listen this is way better than banjo kazooie corruptions have ever been just randomly so this is pretty this is pretty good this is a step forward and banjo kazooie has always been one of the harder games to corrupt so this is amazing um i'm very tired i want to get to gameplay real quick try a couple more and then I'm done. With corruptions. I have one more thing. Art is gonna be like tomorrow. Just because it's it's getting late and... Again, I started really late because the corruptor... I ran into problems with it. And I needed technical help. But, um... Sonic thing. I had some stupid Sonic ROMs planned for you. 
I'll either do that during the week or definitely next Sunday. But I mean, this is this is a pretty impressive thing. I mean, this is a special occasion. We've got a brand new corruptor, and it's pretty good. Needs some work, but pretty damn good. Maybe my computer is just making it suck. Because they seem to... Like... You know... Those that made these corruptions and Irkluzar seem to have less problems with it than I do. But I will do He Thick after this. Part 2. Which will probably only last like 10 minutes anyway, so I don't know what it- what it's gonna be like. It's probably gonna suck. How could it be good? How could he thick number two be good? The instrumentation changed a bit. It's like incorporated the underwater music. Banjo got a big fist. Whoa. No, we don't like that. We need to lower that. Gravity just got crazy. Seriously, I can barely jump, I can barely move. from that, Banjo. Banjo! This game is resilient, man. It's, Banjo stretches, he turns inside out, he gets wide, he gets thick, and then he fixes himself. Okay, I don't think he's coming back from this one. pop music. Okay. So, there you go. That was Banjo Kazooie Corruptions. And that was RTC 3.0. That's um, extremely impressive, Phil. You did a good job there. <laughs> Infinite remixes. You know, if you're ever looking for electronic remixes of your favorite N64 songs, then you know where to find it. Uh, the last thing I'm going to do, and again, please understand, as a wise man once said, please understand, the reason I wouldn't do the art tonight is simply because there's probably going to be a ton of it. And, you know, I'm, I'm really tired today.
let's see, at least two pages, three pages, almost three pages. It's not, it doesn't seem, seem like a lot, but I can give you a little bit more streaming instead. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to play Heathick, and then I'm going to go to bed.